Welcome to this uh, shortwave radio channel, and this is the beginner series for shortwave radio. This is part three, and in part three, we're going to examine why exactly you might not receive anything on your shortwave radio. So there are a few things, and of course, each of the reasons why you might not receive anything, we're going to, of course, talk about it and have separate videos of some of the things you could do to improve. One of the things I see very often in the Facebook group and the YouTube comments is, okay, I bought this radio that you said was good. I turn it on, I hear nothing. I don't hear anything on shortwave. What could be wrong? Is my radio broken? Chances are your radio is fine. For the most part, when you don't hear anything, there are several things that can happen. The most common reason why you won't hear anything is noise. Unfortunately, there's a lot of noise in our modern day technology. And if you try to listen, especially if you live in an apartment building or if you live in a densely populated area, there might be just too much noise and it's actually dominating your radio. And so we're going to talk about noise, how to find where this noise might come from, how to, uh, we'll have tips on how to avoid it and try to test out your radio and see if it works. So noise is probably the number one reason you're not receiving anything. That means that you need to get away from that noise to receive something. Um, one of the re things, one of the things that you can actually do to uh, reduce that noise is also use external antenna instead of the telescopic that comes with the radio piece of wire or something outside. Of course, we'll deal with that in another video for beginners. So you can move outside and see if something is better. Um, one of the reasons you might not hear anything or not a lot is the time of day. I just posted a video when some of the times that are better to listen to shortwave. Maybe you're listening at midday around noon or 11 a.m. That's kind of the time of day where there's not that much happening. So you might not be receiving anything because of that. That's also a possibility. Maybe by accident, um, there's some form of geomagnetic storming or solar, solar flare or something happening with the sun because the sun and the Earth geomagnetic field actually can degrade shortwave propagation. It could be a temporary thing, something happening while you were trying to tune around, but since you don't know all of this, you don't know that it's happening, and you don't know that it actually is maybe making signals weaker than usual, and you're not actually getting anything. So these are different things. It could be a setting on your radio that's wrong. Remember that a lot of radios have um, switches that actually sometimes called local or DX. Well, if your switch is on local, the radio is not as sensitive. That also means that it's not going to receive weaker stations, so it might actually prevent you from listening. So it could be a setting or something within your radio that's just not set right. But like I said, most of the times, your radio's fine. It's just that it's not... Um, it's just not in a, um, you know, either a good time or something is just not right. And of course, we'll talk about that in separate videos to help you out in getting more signals. So remember that these radios are very sensitive in general. Also, remember that depending on where you live around the world, some regions of the world, it's a little more difficult to receive stations than others. For example, in Europe, there's a lot more to listen to than there is in North America. If you live in the western part of North America, signals tend to be weaker over there. Um, if you live in Australia, well, it's a little more difficult in Australia to get shortwave. Um, so it depends on where you live also. That's very important. So more videos coming up. Hope that we'll uh, be able to help you out in having your first signals. And uh, we're going to talk about everything possible that will help you in this series to uh, have fun with that brand new radio that you purchased 
or that brand new hobby of yours. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.